Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to my channel. So right now I am actually at the house. Um, I came over to turn off our lights um, and then also to do a second coat on the paint swatches that I actually bought. Um, yesterday, my cousin and her husband, um, he's actually gonna be the one painting our entire house. So he came over to look at the house and you know just tell us how much it would be and how much paint um, we would need. Um, and he did actually put some paint on the wall just for me to see the differences of the whites. And honestly, you guys, it all looks like the same to me. Um, just on the samples that I actually got, um, they do look a little bit more different, but when they are on the wall, I don't see much of a difference. So he did paint some swatches on the wall and I just have to decide which one, um, you know, I want to use. And like I said, they all look similar to me, so um, it is a little bit hard, but I am going to try to match it with like the cabinets, um, you know, just so it's not so different, uh, which I know it's gonna be a little bit different, but you know, in the future, we're gonna probably repaint the cabinets anyways. Um, so I'm not really worried about that. It doesn't need to be exactly the same, you know, as the, the kitchen cabinets or the moldings that we do have throughout the house or anything. Um, we also do have shutters, so I have to take that into consideration. So it's a lot, you know, that I just need to make sure that I pick the right color. Um, but yeah, let me show you guys um, the colors right now. All right, so this is one of them. This is the first one here. I actually just did a second coat on this and you could still kind of see um, the gray. And the first coat was done yesterday. So um, yeah, you can still kind of see the, you know, the uh, gray color. And this is the color sample that I got. Um, this one is Sherwin-Williams Extra White, which I actually really like this color on the little samples that I actually got because it's like a really bright white and I just love it. Um, and then if you can see these other two, um, I still haven't done the second coat. Um, this one definitely needs, you know, another coat. So this one is also from Sherwin-Williams. This one is, I believe it's High Reflective White. Um, that's the name of it. And then he did put the samples down just so I can, you know, know which ones they were. Um, and this one is also from Sherwin-Williams. This one is pure white. So those are the three options that I'm, you know, just doing. I'm not gonna go crazy and buy so many whites just because, I mean, I just need to pick one. Um, but yeah, I am going to decide which one I do like. Um, and if you guys can see the house is you know, a gray color. Um, this actually gray that's right here, um, let me show you guys, because it is different than the one over here. So this is a lighter gray that they did. Um, and you guys can tell the difference right here. So this is the lighter gray and then this is the darker gray. Um, yeah, so, and I believe they did that probably because of the kitchen. Um, since they did actually do the island, it looks like the same color that's, you know, on the walls. So, um, yeah, and I am recording you guys with my iPhone just because I did it. I did forget my camera, um, where we're staying at. So, um, yeah, I have to record with my iPhone right now. Um, but yeah, guys, um, I'm going to decide which one I like and we will see which one I pick and see how it all turns out. We are doing the entire house white. And I was actually even thinking of having him just paint this white. Um, these are, what are they? Like a rock or something? I don't even know what they are. But I was just thinking of having him do it white. And then I was planning on doing um, like this, this here black. In the future, I do want to tear this down and do something else here, which I can't wait to do also. Um, but, you know, for the meantime, I think it would just be best if I do have him paint it all white since, you know, everything is gonna be pretty much white here. Um, I think it would just, you know, look better. 
but let me know what you guys think down below in the comment section. Um, should I paint it also white or should I just leave it? Um, let me know. And yeah, I can't wait to see the whole entire house white, you guys. I love white. And another thing I didn't mention to you guys is that we are actually going to be painting the walls and we are also going to be painting the ceilings that same color, whichever color I choose. Um, just because I know this color that's right now on the ceiling, it is a white, but it is like a beige kind of color. Um, you guys already know there's so many types of whites out there. So he is doing the entire ceiling um, around the whole house um, and the walls as well. Um, but yeah, so you guys can see this is a different gray and then also the ceilings um, are, you know, like an off-white color. So I just all want it to match. Yeah, baby. Okay, just don't wake up your brother, okay? He fell asleep right now when we were on the way over here. So I just put him right here in the playroom with Dominic. I take the line off. I did take the line and put it right there. Okay. Okay, baby. Can you break the hammer? No, baby. Just be careful, okay? Don't Don't get hurt with that. Um, and then, like I mentioned to you guys, we are going to be replacing the carpet. That is going to happen probably like in about a week or so. Um, so we will see when that happens. He's actually really loving the playroom. I'm so happy that he does um, just because, you know, this room is going to be for them. And I can't wait to decorate it and, you know, do everything that I plan to do here in this room for them. Um, but yeah, guys, I cannot wait to show you guys how the house looks, you know, um, after we do paint it and everything. I'm so excited. I can't wait to take those down, um, those curtains and the curtain rods as well. By the time you guys watch this video, I probably already have decided on the white, but just leave me a comment down below letting me know which color, um, you know, you think I should do. Um, if you guys, see, oh, let me actually show you guys the little samples that I got. That way you guys can kind of tell the difference on the colors. All right, guys, so these are the colors. Let me place them in order of how I have them on the wall. Um, but this one is Sherwin-Williams Extra White. Um, this one is High Reflective White and then Pure White. They're all from Sherwin-Williams. And I don't know if you guys can tell like the difference, but this one for sure to me is the whitest one, the, the high reflective white. And then this one to me is the second white. And this one has like a yellowish color to it um, that I can actually kind of tell or it's a little bit more of a beige um, white. So, you know, comparing the three, I think I do prefer the Sherwin-Williams Extra White, but leave me in the comment section down below which one do you think I should do? Or if you guys have used any of these colors, let me know down below as well. Um, but yeah, I am leaning towards this one here, which is Sherwin-Williams Extra White. <laughs>
just did some swatches over here by the kitchen just so i can see you know like the how the colors match with the cabinets and as you guys can see i only did one coat so i definitely need to do another one because um you can still see a lot of the gray um but the top one here is the sherwin williams extra white the second one is the whitest white. You can, I think you guys can tell. Um, that is the high reflective white. And then the bottom one is Sherwin Williams pure white. Um, and yeah, I think I'm leaning towards the top one though, um, just because it is basically in between um, like these two. So I feel like this one has more beige in it and yellow. Um, this one is just like super, super stark white. And this one is just, you know, a very nice white. Um, and I do see how, you know, it looks next to our cabinet color. Um, and I think they would look nice. And obviously you guys can see that um, we do have these subway tiles, which are, you know, more of a beige color. Um, but I still think that, that the white will look really nice all around our kitchen um, right here. Um, and like I mentioned to you guys in the future, I do have plans for the kitchen. God willing, one day in the future, I do have, you know, other plans of how I want my kitchen to look. But for now... Um, I do actually really love it. Um, they did a really nice job when they designed the kitchen and they upgraded everything and did all of the changes that they did. Um, I do really like it. Um, I love our Long Island right here and just how big the kitchen is because the kitchen does come all the way over here. And then we do have the little desk area right here, which is really nice also. Um, but yeah, I just love our kitchen and i can't wait to replace the light fixtures and stuff but little by little you guys um so yeah i can't wait to come back and do a second um swatch of these colors um just to see more of the true color like i did right over here um so they probably are dried a little bit more so you guys can see it is still a bright white but this one, I feel like it is a lot brighter um, and like its name, more reflective. And then this one is the pure white. Um, it does look really white as well, um, but I don't know. It just might be the lighting and all of that. But yeah, let me know what you guys think down below.